was my arrangement of two very well-known songs, Let It Be by The Beatles and No Woman No Cry by Bob Marley. I coupled them together because they shared the same chord progression, really. Very similar. Now, today I'd like to break one of those tunes down for you and, uh, and, and show you how, how to play it in a simple fashion and how to put an arrangement of a, of a song together. There are so many great songs that work wonderfully on the guitar. There's quite an art, though, in, in putting them together and in trying to put them together. We're presented with quite a few problems that we need to overcome. But once you do get your favourite songs down and you can play them, like I just did with those two, it's very rewarding and it's a whole lot of fun. Now the tune, Let It Be, seems to work in four bar sequences, which is what most songs do, four and eight bar sequences quite often. Although it's a 12 bar tune, really, we've got four or three sets of four bars. Now the first set of four bars, of course, it's made up of a melody, some chords and a bass line which we're putting all together at once. But let's start with the bass. Half a bar on C, then it goes to G, but I put B in the bass, so that's what we call a slash chord. G with B in the bass. G slash B, A, then F. Then we go C, G, and a little tumble down of F, D, C. So let's talk that, or count that through. Three, four, one, two, Now the chords that will fit over that are C, G with B in the bass, A minor, F, C, G, and our little walk. So let's play that through. Three, four. the melody that goes over the top. Slowly. parts together, although we're really only hinting at the chords. We need to know what the chords are, but we're, it's really just bass and, lo and, and the melody line. Here it is. Those four bars are then basically repeated. So, so the, the last four bars of the 12 bar sequence, the bass line A, G, F, C, C, G, F, E, D, C. So it's, it's very similar, it's just the first two bars are different to the first two bars of the, you know, the, the original phrase. So play that with me, three, four, A, two, G, four, F, two, C, C, two, four. There's a little fluff there, but now to play that, uh, that with the chords, A minor, G, goes now all three parts together now 
if you have a little trouble grabbing that G, the big G on the sixth string third fret, you can play it third string open. Let's look at it like that. Okay, now the whole thing 